Hi, it's Gemma. Um, I am unboxing some Amazon yellow lens retro look sunglasses today. Um, I think a good sunglass and a statement yellow tinted lens really elevates any look and gives you kind of like an, a cool edge that's vintage looking. This is a place where I would usually splurge or do some thrifting, but I've been unemployed for four months and I just can't seem to land a job. So right now I am not spending money on things that I can find more cheaply elsewhere. So I have about eight pairs that I'm gonna look at today. This first pair is a super thick, like 90s style frame. Um, it comes in this little plastic glass, uh, or case, excuse me, with a cloth for cleaning and a little cloth bag, which I actually really appreciate. It's great for throwing in your bag, keeps everything scratch free. They are also wrapped pretty well. Um, I I like these. I don't love how like shiny they are. They kind of look a little bit cheap, but hey, they were cheap and um, beggars can't be choosers right here. But I like them. They're a maybe. This pair, I really like how much um, they come with. So they come with a little screwdriver so you can keep the arms nice and tight. I love the cloth bag again and the additional um, you know, cleaning lens bag. I really like the shape of these. They're wrapped really well. I actually think these might be my favorite pair. I know we're gonna look at a few others, but yeah, I really like these. They have more of a weight to them. They feel really secure when you're um, opening the arms up and they have a really good shape that feels kind of oversized, um, a little bit more kind of 80s. And yeah, these are definitely more my speed than the first pair for sure. So now we're getting into our box. There's a few other pairs in here. So watch me cut into this and try to not cut my fingers. Um, yeah, like in this box, we have more pairs that kind of look 90s, some more 70s pairs, and they really span the decades. So this particular pair, it can't, this is my favorite kit for how it comes. It comes with a, like a legit case, which is almost like a Ray-Bans case. And these were not expensive. I will list everything and put the prices in for all of these pairs of sunglasses. Um, these are wrapped really well. Um, pretty much all of them are. They have that additional plastic on the sleeve that I do really appreciate because it doesn't um, scratch the lens. Um, what I like about these is they're almost like that brand Persol. They're like definitely a rip of that brand, um, but an economical rip, like a pair of Persol sunglasses is gonna, you know, lend you in a um, hundred plus two hundred dollar bit of credit card debt. I like them, they're a good weight. This pair I actually really love, they surprised me. Like the others, they don't come with like the same sick case as the last pair, but they have the cleaning cloth, the cloth bag that also doubles as a cleaning cloth that I love because it's not bulky in a purse. These have a really good weight to them. Um, these were not very expensive at all, but they feel kind of substantial and expensive. As you can see, like they actually are kind of like thicker, the frame. I'm gonna show you just sort of the thickness of them. And they feel great. Um, all right, so we're heading into a pair that are a little bit lighter. Definitely have that classic Ray-Ban look. Um, another cloth bag, another day, another cloth bag. Um, but these are definitely a lot more flimsy as I'm unwrapping them like they feel really like yeah flimsy that's the best word for them however they do just have like a very classic um for the price they yeah they felt pretty good even though they were flimsy this is the last pair and this was definitely a little bit more of a stretch for me in terms of their style. They came with something that I did not unpack. I am assuming that is a bag. Um, they have a thicker arm, which is definitely not my style per se, but I was trying to branch out here and just do something new. It's like pretty low investment, right? They also have that wrap on the arm, which I really love. And yeah, what do you think?